prayer is to say, I see a possibility of good in my trial and I can step into it. So you don't get stuck in your littleness. When you come to nature, you will study nature's principle, which tells you that life itself is about pain. You see, life did not offer you straight roads. We did not come to the earth to have smooth earth. We have in mountains and valleys. No river goes to the ocean in straight path. Get to know this of me. I'm a universal citizen. And I come from Africa. So nature is my teacher. So I learn from that great book called Nature Itself. When you watch rivers, they meet with obstacles, but they still find the alternate route. So they enter the ocean or wherever their destination should be. So life is about pain. But if you observe, pain is not about you. Pain is about calling out your magnificence into expression. When we read about any success story of any person, it's about trials and the triumph over the trials. It's about situations of pains in which the person found some alternate route and made his or her success through it. So no one is interested in your sad stories. Whatever situation you find yourself, you are there to be a teacher, a healer, or you are choosing to be a victim. So whether you are in the war zones in the Middle East, in Africa, or wherever, you have a decision to be a healer and a teacher. Else it gets worse. And if you choose the victim path, believe me, it will continue to get worse for you. We are not here in life to walk through for nothing to happen. Life did not place you here there to see the problem for you to do nothing about it. You are there to do something about it. This is where your prayer comes in. This is where you realize that you are not alone. You are a part of a cosmic whole. 